Hello Aries, so I'm going to do a love bonus reading for you today. Uh, Spirit, what have we got? Messages here coming in for Aries for love and relationships. What do they need to see for love, crushes, relationships, any of the above? What do they need to see? Something here about children. Ooh, and there's chemistry. Strong magnetic attraction. I feel like it could be children or lack thereof if you don't have any children. It says it's being affected by children. Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at play. Divine timing is always at play. So, <laughs> Underlying energy is passion. So we've got the moon today. Um connected to Jupiter, I believe. So there is good luck. Moon and Gemini, variety. So let's see what we have. Messages for Aries, please, for love, crushes, relationships. Spirit, what is the message here for Aries? What they need to see for love, crushes, and relationships. page of it swords so we've got a <laughs> we have a watcher I was gonna say a stalker we have a watcher an observer somebody's got a lot of ideas six of coin in the crossing earth energy support payments balance something being raised up the judgment, divine timing, spiritual renewal, queen of the air, Libra, ooh, someone's rushing in, there's an urgent message, five of wands, competition, striving, my goodness, Aries, tower with this. Somebody here goes in a new direction, or they feel like they want to. You're wanting to have patience in a situation, emotional. You're wanting to have a balanced approach. Like, you're not wanting to jump off any bridges and take risks. You're not wanting to, I don't mean jump off bridges. I mean, like, you don't want to be the fool. You don't want to be foolish. You're wanting to, but the tower is like, you're having a strong realization. This Knight of Cups comes forward. Energy of a water sign or somebody with a poetic message. And um, why is there a tower here for Aries? Why is this so shocking? Star. Hmm. The star represents, the, so the tower and the star means something's water under the bridge. It's going to be moved out, healing. Okay, what do we have for five of swords? Wow. A couple. And happiness. Not, I said five of swords, it's five of wands. There's competition here. There could be a soulmate, somebody who's wanting to come towards you. Um, what are we getting raised up? Judgment is like a resurrection. A divine calling. What is the Knight of Swords? Somebody rushes in. Could be somebody creating drama. What is this Knight of Swords rushing in? I got the Knight of Wands, Fire Energy, and the Wheel. Something changing. Um, what is the Knight of Cups? The Poetic Message. Oh my gosh. Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Long-term commitments. Ten of Pentacles. Underlying energy, five of pentacles, feeling abandoned, feeling lost, 
feeling left out in the cold. Someone around you is wanting to go in a new direction. They're inspired, they're wanting to, they're trying to think of a way or they're choosing, a, uh, they're choosing to come towards you. I think you caught someone's eye here, five, six of wands, nine of coin. All right, tower and the star. Something is very shocking, but it's very healing. Uh, new beginning offers you a lot of hope. There's this message that comes through with the Knight of Water. What is the Knight of... No. What is the Two of Wands? Okay. So, same energies are sort of... Ah! Popping. What? 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 I dropped it. Okay. Got an Ace of Coin. New opportunity. Ten of Wands in reverse. Somebody is dropping burdens. They're saying... I'm coming towards the Aries. Kind of with a 50-50, but they're, you do like this. They come with a Six of Pentacles. Hermit in the reverse. This person's coming forward. We got the Judgment. Resurrection. Bottom of this deck is a Ten of Pentacles and a Four of Wands. Okay. What is the Knight... Okay, what is the Knight of Water? Poetic, creative, messenger of emotions and feelings. What is this Knight of Water? Mm, the Page of Swords in the reverse. So somebody is going to come forward. They're going to take a risk. Ace of Swords on the bottom. New information. Ooh, the Devil and the World and the Fool. This is very tempting. Wanting to walk away and start fresh. Wanting a new beginning here. The world and the fool is Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. Okay. So it says divine timing is at play. Somebody's coming forward. They've waited long enough. I feel like that is what it is. Ten of Wands in the reverse. They've waited long enough. They're coming towards you. Um. The underlying energy is divine timing with the judgment. It's Archangel Gabriel blowing a message, blowing a horn, waking up a situation. So, to somebody sees you as their other half, perhaps, two of cups. Now, that could be a friend as well. The sun comes out. This is really happy. There's a lot of happiness around this. Um, Knight of Swords is what you become aware of. Rapid communication. The messenger of maybe conflict. Knight of Ace, Ace of Swords with the Devil. Could be a Capricorn. But I will leave this here. Thank you, Aries, for turning into your love bonus reading. And take care.